Haley here. Welcome back to another Royal High video on my channel. If you're new, make sure to subscribe for weekly Royal High videos and don't forget to tap that bell notification so you know exactly when I'm like I'm posting a brand new Royal High video. Oh my gosh, I talk so fast there. Okay, anyways, in today's video, I'm going to be doing an interview with a person who has won the Halloween Halo 2020 from the fountain. They offered for me to interview them in the comments. Here's the picture on the screen right now. Their comment, my response, things like that. I know this is a little late and people have already interviewed people but I asked them more questions than just how did you win it like what answer what story I asked like ha like what have people offered for it things like that how they feel about it and I got them to show it in different color variations things like that so go ahead and keep watching the video for those types of things about the halo and yeah let's get into it Alright, so here I am. I am with Ben. Their outfit's super cute, so I went ahead and just told them that their outfit's, like, really cute. And, yeah, so there is their halo on their head. It looks so cool. Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, so they made their halo yellow for their outfit, as you can see. So here is a close-up of the halo. As you can see, the crows do move around the moon, but not only that, but the moon moves around as well, which I think is really cool. And also, it kind of sparkles, and it's just so cool looking. The moon sparkles, the bottom of the halo sparkles, and I think that's like a curtain under the halo. It's kind of translucent, and I think this halo is really, really unique and really cool. I love how the crows move. That's so unique, and yeah. Alright, so I asked them what day did they get the halo. I'm curious how far out from when this halo came out. They said two days ago, so currently it's October 16th when we're recording this. So they got this on October 14th. That is so cool. Um, they're so lucky for that. So I'm just asking the basic questions. I'm asking what story did they get? So let's go ahead and see what story they got. There's currently only three stories on the fountain. There's like the potion one. Uh, what else is there? The costume one and something else. The story where the witch asks you to join the potion contest. Yes, so the potion one. That's really cool. Okay, well, what answer? Oh. I chose the sleepy potion. So that's answer A. That's the answer everyone's saying can get you the halo. And now we have actual proof of this person saying that's what got them the halo. So if you do get that fountain story, I recommend doing that. And that is option A. I'm asking right now if that's option A. But um, yeah, then my screen was purple and I got the badge. Yeah, it's option A. Okay, so... Your screen turns purple, and then, yeah, then you get the badge. So, that's what happens. So, if you ever go to the fountain, and, like, it's you just put in the answer and nothing happens, you didn't get the halo. So, don't even bother reading this story. Honestly, I don't. But, yeah. Okay, so they said, all I know is that the screen turns purple or black. Okay, so purple or black, guys. Remember that. Um, if the screen flashes a dark color, then, you know, you want it. So, yeah. So, then I asked, how many times did you wish at the fountain before you got the halo? If you can't remember about how many times before. I'm just wondering how many tries it took until they got the halo. Because sometimes people get it on the first try. Sometimes people get it on, like, the 50th try. I'm just curious. About three to four times. About three to four times a day. So, they, like, did it every two hours, I'm assuming, by how they're saying that. Because that's a lot of times for a whole day. Because you have to wait two hours to even wish at the fountain once so i'm assuming that they actually just did it every two hours all right i asked whoa so did you start wishing out the fountain every day right when it came out i'm curious because a lot of people usually just like randomly do it you know i'm i'm wanting to know like how hard did they work to wish at the fountain and get the halo because i've been working so hard i've been wishing every two hours i really want this halo like really bad i love how it looks it's like one of my dream ha halos now like besides the light halo and the halloween halo 2019 this is my dream halo to be honest but yeah um this is way too cute for me like oh my god Alright, so they said, yeah, I saw the picture and said, I need that halo. Now I have it. <laughs> That's literally what I want to do. Like, I need this halo. 
and I don't have it, but it's okay. Um, I'm too poor to even try to trade for it, too. I wish I had diamonds, but it's alright. Um, but yeah, that's literally me, honestly, except I don't have the halo. Alright, so I, I said, wow, the luck, lol. I hope I get the halo from the fountain, too. I have been going every two hours. Did you do that, too? Because... Some people just randomly get it without even going every two hours. Some people do. I'm curious. How, how did it work out for them? Yes, I really wanted this halo. Okay. <laughs> Mood. Alright, so I asked them if they could change the halo colors, you know, randomly to see, like, what colors the halo would look like. So here's a really cute tar turquoise? Turquoise. Yeah, turquoise color. Um, it's really pretty. I like that, too. Like, I'm starting to love turquoise, so, um, I'm blessed. Oh, and it's two colors. Ooh, really? So you can, like, change the colors. That's cool. Oh my gosh. Okay, here's red, yellow. They already did yellow, but there's red. There's turquoise, and there's a little bit more blue. There's, like, a magenta. There's light pink, it looks like. There's black. There's so many colors that look really cool. I really like this. Um, let me know if you like the random color variants. I like the light pink one. Like, oh my gosh. They're kind of changing a little fast, but I think y'all saw it. It's really cute. Slow down the video if you want to see a specific color. It's so pretty. I love it so much. Alright, so my next question is, is this the first Halo that you have ever owned? I'm curious, like what the luck was like do they own like eight halos like what is going on like i'm curious um they said yes then i traded things for more halos so i guess they have more than one halo now but this was the first halo they owned i'm not sure but anyways let's go ahead and look in their journal and see the badge all right so here is the badge blessed with the halloween halo 2020 that is so cool um they're so lucky to even have that badge in their journal that is really cool but i got so many trade offers for it they all are really good oh my gosh so they got traded things for it what do people usually offer they were talking while i was looking at the badge and just looking at it in all of its glory i'm curious what do people trade for this halo so a couple sets and a parasol some of the people that don't have a lot give their whole inventory whoa their whole entire inventory for halo that just came out that just what i i a lot of stuff has anyone offered other halos that's what i'm like really curious about like mm -hmm. halo for halo mm -hmm. did my elector just go off <laughs> Anyways, the halos that people are trading are the winter halos and valentine's halos. Um, it's not the older new halos, because if it's the new ones, oh my gosh. <laughs> the older new, please tell me, because oh my gosh. If it's the new halos, that would be a little bit too much. Okay, the old. Alright, so that's a little bit fair, I guess, because they are the lower tier halos. But you still have no idea how much the halo is worth yet because it's still being given out in the fountain and more people can win it and the rarity could be less or go up. So I don't think you should trade this halo if you have it because the rarity will definitely be different compared to just now because like I feel like it's just going to keep changing depending on how many people win this at the fountain. So yeah, just be on the lookout for that guys. Anyways, the final question I'm asking is if this Halo is like one of their favorites because it definitely is mine. And I'm just curious, like, do they actually like the Halo that they won? Like, I'm sure they do because they said they really wanted it. I, I'm just curious though, like, why do they want it? Is it because they want to trade it away at eventually? Or like, what are they doing? You know, that's what I'm wanting to know. Anyways, they said, yeah, I love this Halo. It's my favorite. Yes, exactly. This Halo is amazing. I love it so much. I think it's one of my favorites, actually. Well, no, it is. <laughs> Anyways, that's like all the questions I have for Ben. So thank you so much for offering me to interview the, you. Like if you're watching this video, like thank you so much. I wouldn't have been able to make this video without you. You're so sweet and I appreciate you for giving me this offer. It was so fun interviewing you. Alright guys, so that's the end of this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and also subscribe for weekly Royal High videos. And don't forget to tap that bell notification so you know exactly when in the week I'm posting a brand new Royal High video. Thank you so much to the person who offered me to interview them. It means a lot to me. Thank you so much. You're so kind and good, like, 
good job on getting the halo congratulations anyways i wish you guys so much luck to winning a halo any halo getting a halo from trading or even winning it from the fountain i need a lot of luck right now because i really need that halo and anyways i'm gonna go wish of the fountain right now so yeah i hope you guys have an amazing day bye